Hey guys, hey. Woo woo. Yes, Hello. Hi, am. What have we got today to show people? Uh, I don't know where they are. Other than the cupboard. Yeah. They're in the cupboard. And so, today for our dessert, our afters, we're going to be trying these new flavour of Pop Tarts. It's Schmalls. Do you guys have pop tarts for dessert or do you have them for breakfast? No, because it's like possibly the most unhealthy breakfast ever, right? <laughs> it really is. There's all sorts of red on this packet. Oh, yeah. Per pop tart, it's about four grams of fat. 789 calories. 187 calories. Per, oh, per gosh, thing? Oh gosh, yeah. I imagine so. It's per... Is that good or bad? I don't know. I feel like that's low calories for a pop tart. I don't know. Have you I read just, it right? I, I just think. Well, I don't. I'm just going off and saying 48 grams. Yeah, each one's 48 grams, so each one's 187 calories. Which, when you think how long it would take to get up to 187 calories on a treadmill, it's quite depressing. But still, I thought it'd be like 400 calories of a thing. So it's yeah, the two in each pack. Yeah. It's a classic look. And it just tells you how not to microwave and just pop it in the back. Uh, yeah, pop it in the back. <laughs> Don't microwave yeah. it, but pop it in the microwave. And so yeah, looking at the picture on the front, it looks like it's just a classic brownie colour. Let's see what it looks like when we open it up. As you sure <laughs> they spoil us by putting yes, uh, a good amount on the top of them. Yeah, they're now reasonably well covered, but but not like they look in the picture, are they? Nah, that's pretty. They never how they look in the picture. Why do people say that about me? <laughs> so yeah, we'll pop those down for a, a minute or however long it takes to the pops, and then we will try them. Maybe away from the washing machine. <laughs> yeah. So. So they're out. They smell okay. They smell quite nice. Mm. Smell like warm cardboard. <laughs> and so, yeah. And they break it open. I suppose we'll. Oh. What is that? Why is it that colour? I suppose it is the colour in there, but that's colour not. Colour what though? It's just like a caramel cup. Where's the marshmallow? It just says chocolate marshmallow flavour, but when you think of s'mores, do you think, think of it being like white marshmallow, not brownie, translucent goo. Ah, it's hot! It is. <laughs> That's what Paris Hilton told you. <laughs> oh no, where's the actual marshmallow? Mm. I'm not getting a lot of flavour at all really, just sweetness. Yeah. That's not what a s'mores is like. No. We've made s'mores before I turn. There's literally no universe where that is a s'more. S'mores? S'mores? S'more? So yeah, I'd say unless you're a massive Pop-Tart fan of Definitely wouldn't pay the full price for it to get reduced because they are. Obviously, we might not be the demographic because we're not really pop tart people, but. Cocoa and marshmallow flavour. Also, you can imagine the top it cuts the taste of the cocoa, but. It is just like. Looks like just glue. That's okay. awful. So yeah, I wouldn't recommend it if I'm honest. It's just another in the long line of Pop Tarts that I would not eat again. Do any of you guys eat Pop Tarts? Any flavours you would recommend? Cause... It's a shame because the concept of a Pop Tart is a good it's one. such a good concept. Yeah, because it's, just... it's a shape, still shelf stable thing that 
just takes like a minute in the toast to book. I just can't get my head around why they can't get it right. Do you guys like Pop Tarts or what? Because I feel like I'm like on my own. Well, obviously, you don't really like them. I don't think many. But yeah, they're so crazily popular. Anyway, yeah. That's our little verdict on it. Yeah. Hey, hey guys, so we didn't realise until afterwards that there is another place that does s'mores pop tart. Pop <laughs> style tarts. They call them toast and pop ups, but as you can see, that is probably more what we imagined, where it's like, looks like the marshmallow and the chocolate. But just a little fact for everyone. What year do you think the first pop tart was made by Kellogg's? Answer now, guys. I say eighteen seventy eight. Well, that's stupid, isn't it? <laughs> is it? I don't know. I, I thought that it was quite a modern thing. Nineteen sixty four. All oh, right, okay. See, I was the a toaster even invented in eighteen whatever. You said came up with. I don't know. And I see. I thought that. I thought it was like more of a modern thing. But it'd be very surprised, like. How some things have been around for a long time, you don't know how they are, but they are. Anyway, so these we bought, you can get them from Iceland for £1.50, but there are only six in a pack. It's a similar thing. Seems like this firm has started one year after Kellogg's and then it went out of favour and it's just come back for the moment. But we thought we'll try these and see how they compare because we were a little bit disappointed. However, these ones initially don't look <laughs> much better. We have toasted wow. these to save you the pain and also the washing machine was spinning at the time. Yeah, so I said let's just sit out of the way of it. So do you want to break it in half and we'll see what they look like inside? Well, that's a bit more like what I was expecting. Yeah, it's not the perfect stripes <laughs> in the thing, but... You can see is. white marshmallowy looking stuff and some chocolatey looking stuff. It smells quite similar to be fair. But... Yeah. It doesn't taste as sweet. The biscuit's probably not as nice as the pop tart one, but. I suppose when you look at that. A little bit there, you can see the stripes a bit more. Mm. That's the thing I was hoping for, something that was a bit more like wagon wheel. Mm. So what do you say there? I'd say they're a bit better. Mm. But I'd say it's still not something that I'd repurchase. No. And these are more expensive, weren't they? No, the pop tart. I think the pop tarts were three pounds. What these three pound fifty? These were two pounds thirty. Oh. Right. Oh, but in Iceland, if we'd found them there, they were a lot more cheaper as well. If you want to try them, Iceland's one pound fifty at the moment. But yeah, they they're less sweeter. They remind me a little bit of a wagon wheel. They are lower, only slightly lower calories than the pop tart ones and the pop tart ones did taste a lot sweeter to me but yeah if you wanted ones with M mcdonald's in. well if you want the ones with the uh, marshmallow in i'd go for the the ones at iceland but i'd still say that they're both possibly a, a pass for me mm. but now we've got two boxes and we have to eat yeah <laughs> i know i think it might be nice maybe with some vanilla ice cream or something so you have like the hot pop tart with a something to like Wash it down, but yeah. anyone got any ideas how to use them? Is get a bowl of vanilla ice cream, throw those away, and just eat the ice cream. Anyway, guys, <laughs> yeah, that's our little uh, schmoz toasted pocket thing. Let us know if you've tried any of them. If you think they, if any of them are good to you or whatever. And this time we will speak to you in the next video. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>